So this is a uh, quick demo of performing the IP3 or third order intercept measurement on the PXI5663 as well as on the Rodian Schwartz FSQ. Uh, this is our test setup here. You can see the uh, PXIE1065 chassis with the 5673 which is generating our test signal. That's going back to our 5663 as well as our Rodian Schwartz FSQ. And so we're, gonna, we're performing measurements on both of these simultaneously and I'm going to compare the values. And to do that, I'm going to log in remotely into the FSQ. But first, let's take a look at what the NI hardware is reporting. So this is, uh, this is the generation VI. You can see we're generating at 1 gigahertz uh, with two offset tones at 500K off from our carrier. If I run the measurement over here, you can see that we're getting uh, base tones at negative, approximately negative 15.7 dBm, as well as third order tones at approximately negative 70. And if I run the measurement a few times, you'll see that our IP3 value is right at about 11.5 or 11.6. So now I'm going to remote into the into the uh, roadie box. Let's take a look at the measurement over here. You'll see as it starts to update that uh, we're picking up the same, uh, approximately the same values, give or take about a tenth of a dB for uh, the markers one and two, which are our primary tones. Markers three and four are at the same, uh, approximately negative 70 value. And you can see that our third order intercept value is uh, right around exactly the same number. So you, it's, it's oscillating a little bit. It's a little bit noisy uh, because I haven't turned on averaging, but you can see that it averages around approximately 11.6.